Hey guys, welcome back. I'm Double R, and I'm still sick. And this is Kirby Nightmare in Dreamland. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna make, be making a few videos today because this is the first opportunity I've had to just sit down and record. As I said in the part two, I'm deeply sorry for making you guys wait so long for a second part. But, mm, not much I could do about it. It'd probably still be better to wait because when I look back on this, I'll want to sound good. But, oh well, it's fun making these videos anyway, even if I am sick. And either way, it's just cool to look back and think, oh yeah, I was sick right before college. Isn't my life great? I'm just kidding. My life is great. And I just killed a giant telephone. Anyway. Yeah. So in case any of you got mad or frustrated waiting for my part two, I'm still sorry about that. I really hope nobody was hurt thinking people got really mad and we're frustrated waiting for part two. They're like, where the hell is part two of Kirby Nightmare in Dreamland? And then you beat your wife or your red-headed stepchild. I don't know. I really hope no families were hurt because of my actions. It would be very bad. I would not know what to do with myself. Please do not take out your frustration on loved ones or puppies. Do not kick puppies when you're mad. You know, it's, it's, it's okay. Just go to a neighbor's house or go to someone's house who you don't like and beat them up. I do not condone domestic violence on your own family. But other families are okay. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Don't, don't take out your anger or frustration violently. You should always find a peaceful course whether it's, I don't know, yoga, or painting, or doing Let's Plays. It's a great stress reliever. <laughs> not that I would know, this is about part three. But uh, I'm not very stressed right now. I'm, I'm pretty relaxed just playing this game. And I hope you guys come to me and are relaxed. We're already in level five, or door five of level three, two. I honestly forgot. I lost track. And look at these cannons. They are being held by parasols. That doesn't make sense, but no video games make sense, really. Any video game that made sense would not be fun. And ha, they thought I wouldn't see that soda. But I do. Hmm. I feel like the more I talk, the like raspier my voice gets. And then if it gets raspier, I gotta get louder. And if I gotta get louder, then my voice gets raspier, and it's just it's just a vicious circle. But it's the way it has to be. I wanna record my part three. And I probably won't be able to record tomorrow. I will tell you why in a second after I'm done with this part, because I got a laser enemy tailing me, and I thought that would happen. Oh well, better now that he's gone. Um, I guess it doesn't matter. Oh. Laser. Light amplifi- Light amplifi- Light amplification by stimulated emission of radiation. And it ricoch ricochets off hills too. Yes, I am going to college with those reading skills. I am, I am smart. I'm so smart. I'm the smartest man in the world. Ow. Yeah, so that is the actual acronym for laser, in case you didn't know. And trust me, if, if you're taking physics in high school, that will be on a test. So, you know, at least if you're watching this video, you learn something. You learn what laser stands for. Light, amplification, emission, radiation, something I already forgot. Oh, so this, this power is high jump. Uh, you have little super Kirby. Looks like a superhero. Big jump equal big tackle. I guess that's true. Just jump. Gotta watch out for these crash bombs because they will hurt you. I'm pretty sure they only do one damage, even though they one hit kill all other enemies. It doesn't matter. I don't need that. Tomato. We're already at the end of the level. And we're breezing through this. I don't know why I waited so long. 
I'd be done. I could have been done last week. But I already explained why. On top of all that, I am very lazy too. All my personal friends know how lazy I am. Okay, let's do the boss. I don't know who this is, and high jump sucks. So I don't want to do that boss with high jump. I'm gonna get. <laughs> no. Fire. This fire's good. It's not that good, but it's better than laser. And the boss is. Ah. Uh, this guy. He's easy. He's like, if you ever played uh, Kirby 64 in the Crystal Shards, he's like the boss who paints stuff and what he paints comes to life. Really not that hard. In fact, he's already done. I don't know what his name was. Roller paint guy. Skate and paint. I guess that would be a good name for the skate paint guy. Level 3, butter building. Uh oh, uh oh, boom! Boom, bitch! This level's cool. This like the background, the backdrop in this level. I always thought it was later in the game because, you know, the the more doors you get, they they go like vertically, like the more doors the higher up you go in the level. And I always thought that was more something for the end of the game. But alas, I'm wrong and we're already here. And I want the sword. That's all right. Do I want to go in there? I'm so tempted. Uh-huh. I have a feeling we're gonna need stone later in the level. So I'm gonna pick it up. Stone... I never really understood the hat. Like, I know it's some sort of ancient warrior hat. No one could hurt me. Look out below! But I, I don't know exactly know what kind of hat that is. And we have clock. Cluck! In case you ever watched Nintendo Capri Sun. Cluck! Cluck down. <laughs> Awesome. In case you don't know, I'm just as big a Nintendo Capri Sun fan as Grim Pixel. He is awesome. I'm sure I'll get into the story of how I discovered him. Because, hey, if he ever stumbles upon this video, I'm sure he'll enjoy hearing how I learned about Let's Playing. And learned about him specifically. Anyway, so I'm gonna tell you why I'm not gonna be able to record any videos tomorrow. Did I get rid of stone? Because I'm going to need it. Dude. No. I, I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Is there... Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Yes. I knew it. And why... Yes. Haha. -ha. I forgot about that secret in my first file when I was doing this on vacation. <laughs> Clever. I am... See, I am the smartest man. I figured that out. Even though I figured that out when I was in 5th grade, too. I am smart. Okay. So the reason I won't be able to do any recordings tomorrow is I'm going to go visit my friend. He lives in a different town. I have to go on the highway and drive, like, I don't know, 15 minutes to get to where he lives. And he was my best friend in my, in my old town before I moved. Grimpixel is my best friend in my current town, but the friend I'm going to go visit tomorrow was my best friend in my old town. And, um, you know, we're just going to hang out, probably play some video games, get deep, because at the day after tomorrow, he's going to be leaving for college, and he's not going to be going to college in New Jersey like I am. He's going to be going out of state. He's going to be going to Elon which is located in North Carolina, I'm pretty sure. I don't, um, I don't really, I don't know too much about that college, but it must be pretty good. And North Carolina has nice beaches, I've heard, so that's always nice. He's not going there for the beaches, he's going there because it's a good school. I trust him, and I'm sure that's a good move. He did get accepted to where I got accepted, but, you know, I just gotta be happy for him. He's gotta, it's his life, he's gotta do whatever he wants um so yeah I'm gonna go visit him tomorrow and we're gonna kind of say our goodbyes it probably won't be sad I mean we're not gonna never see each other again it's just kind of like the farthest away we've ever been 
It, it was sad when I was young. I, I moved to this town after sixth grade, and uh, he's the only friend I actually stayed in touch with from my old town. And um, we're still best friends, which is awesome. And he's a great way for me to. Uh, well, he's a, he's a great link to my uh, childhood, pretty much. Like, um, you know, if, if he's the only person I could talk about elementary school with, and he, you know, really gets it, which is kind of good for me to have a have a link to the past like that. Some people just completely lose touch with their childhood, and I, I honestly don't know what it'd be like if I didn't have him. Because elementary school was awesome. A lot of, uh, I picked up a lot of my interests, a lot of my nerdiness in elementary school. Anyway, so done talking about that. This is a cool power. Backdrop with the, with the headband. It is a cool power. Hoo-ha! Once I grab a fro, a fro. <laughs> Once I grab that guy's fro, throw him with directional pad. The, um... In Kirby and the Amazing Mirror, the the headband power is actually called Fighter, and it's it's really cool because you like have punches and you can do Hadoukens actually and Shoryukens, Shoryuken. But unfortunately, this is all it does in this game because this game came out first. Yeah. So a little disappointing having played Amazing Mirror and now going back to this game not having it be as cool. So, yeah, gonna go hang out with my friend tomorrow. And another cool thing we're gonna do is watch Pokemon, the first movie. I don't know how many of you are familiar with it, but it's it's the first movie, and it's the one where, you know, Mew and Mewtwo fight. And I'm probably not gonna think it's cool or anything, but we kind of became best friends through that movie. After the movie ended, and, we, and I saw it in theaters back when I was in second grade, I saw him in the theater, and I kind of went up to him, and I was like, dude, what, wasn't that awesome? And he was like, yeah, that was awesome. I, and then we talked the next day in school, and we, we both had the common interest of loving Pokemon, and it just, it's been, been awesome since then. We still both like Pokemon, probably him more than me, because uh, I have not beaten I, can't, I like can't beat a Pokemon game anymore. I guess I just don't have the patience for it. But we're we just uh, we have a lot in common, and it's awesome that we've been able to stay friends for this long. Anyway, I'm sure that none of that's very interesting to you, you people, and uh, I shouldn't be getting so personal in my videos. But who cares? My video. I'm gonna do it the way I want it kind of explain if I can't do, you know, more parts, because I'm going to be busy tomorrow, and I'm going to be busy on Friday too, which leaves Thursday open, I guess, and I still have to finish packing for school, and who knows, maybe more friends are going to want to see me, you never know. Alright, I think this is a good place to leave off, four, four seems to be the magic number, number when it comes to doors. Alright guys, I'll see you next time. Bye.